before we get into the video, if you guys want to get your hands on some cheap and reliable FIFA 15 Ultimate Team coins, then click on the link in the description or go to iJexy.com. You can also get yourself a 5% discount by entering the code CZWA at the checkout. Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to another video. Today I've decided to do a squad builder video as I think the last one was pretty well received and they're obviously really helpful. I mean, whether you buy and sell your team often or not, um, it's always handy to know what sort of teams are out there that you can buy and I think today's one is especially useful because you can get it for under 30k. So whether you've got a lot of coins or not, you know, you can afford it regardless. And it's a pretty good team as well for the, for the price of it. There's a lot of pace in the team, a lot of flair. It's a Barclays Premier League team. It's not a hybrid, it's just a Barclays Premier League team for under 30k. I think it's a pretty good squad, on paper at least. You know, it looks like it's going to be a great team. First of all, I'll show the team and then we will get into the game and yeah, we'll see how we do. Start from the bottom. De Gea in goal. He's obviously a fantastic keeper. I bought him for 1,800 coins, so you know, that's that's really is under 2,000 coins for a really, really solid keeper. There's an upgraded version of him. Uh, However, I didn't get that one as I'm trying to keep it, you know, at a low price because that's what today is all about. You know, a team that you can afford if you haven't got a lot of coins. It's especially good to buy your team right now because since the web app has been down, uh, all the prices have just shot down for players. So, I mean, they're almost like a quarter off of their original price. So, yeah, great time to buy players is now. In uh, defence, we've got Mangala and Onua. I can't really say that name properly. They've both got... Brilliant pace of centre backs. I mean, anything above 75 is is more than enough. Mangala has 76. Onoa has 83, which is obviously sick. They've both got good uh, defending stats. It's not the highest, but they seem to be able to defend really well, regardless of whoever is attacking against them. So that's who I've got into centre back. Left back is Clichy. He's really quick. He's got good defending stat, and he links with uh, Mangala. Other side, we've obviously got Kyle Walker. He's got absolutely sick pace, 91 pace, and 80 physical. You know, he really is difficult to get past down that down that right wing. Uh, and he obviously partners with centre back next to him. In midfield, we've got three pretty quick centre midfielders. That's the sort of player I prefer. Someone fast. So we've got Oscar first of all. I've always found him to be good on this ultimate team. He's got a brilliant shot, even though his, his shot stat might not suggest it. He's actually got a really good long range shot. He's also obviously very quick and good on the ball. Exactly the same thing goes for Cabela and Coutinho. They're all very good on the ball, great ball control and dribbling, which is what I like in midfield. You know, players that can hold on to the ball and then look out for the pass and find it. They've also all got 80 plus passing stat, apart from Cabela, actually. He's got 77 pass. But that doesn't matter, that's, that's still enough to, to play the ball in. We've got a very fast front three. Uh, Elia, left forward, he's got 91 pace, 82 dribble, 4 star skill. Right forward we've got Morales with 88 pace, 83 dribble, obviously 4 star again. And up front we've got Sturridge, got him for only 4,600 coins, he's got 4 star and he's quick and he's got a good shot. So I've got a good feeling about this team, you know, hopefully there's a, there's a lot of pace and flair amongst it and a lot of 4 star skill. I think our whole midfield and attack has got at least 4 star which means it should be able to produce some pretty good goals today. So, without any further ado, let's let's test the team out. I haven't played with it yet. This is 100% the first match I played with the squad. So, you know, for all I know, it, it, it might not even go all that well. Like this is just this is just like on paper so far. It seems like a really good team. So, hopefully, you know, it's going to be as good on the pitch as it as it as it seems uh, on screen. Right. Oh, he's got an 85 rated team. Falcao, Hazard, Quadrado, Yaya Torre, Di Maria, Rooney, Cahill, left back, that's interesting. Onoa and company centre backs. Hugo Lloris in goal and uh, Shems Coleman right back. That is a very, very good team. I'm not sure about Gary Cahill left back. I think it's a link with Hazard. Right, well, he's taken a quick free kick and Sturridge has actually intercepted it. Could be a pretty easy goal here. Yeah, Sturridge has just absolutely buried it into the top corner. It wasn't exactly a well-worked goal. I mean, he made the mistake by passing it short to Sturridge, so all I had to do was finish. Um, Sturridge's obviously got a lot of pace, so he was able to run away from defenders, um, and he finished it unbelievably well. I mean, he was falling, and he's absolutely buried it into the goal against Hugo Lloris. If we, if we can win the ball, there's a good chance we could... Oh, no, that's a, he's just banged it in with Wayne Rooney. Can't do a lot about that. Rooney's got a terrific shot. Very, very lucky slide tackle. Oh, it's a great run, the great ball. Is a finish there? Yes, it is. Brilliant finish from Cabello there. That was a hard angle to score from, but he's, he's just buried it straight into the goal. So far, so good. I mean, we conceded one goal, but we've scored two. So there seems to be a lot of good runs going. I think we could score potentially quite a lot of goals this game. Uh, hopefully, that'll be the case. Is there a run being made? Yes, there is. Brilliant ball to Sturridge. Nice little turn. It's a finish there. Yes, it is. Lovely little goal there from Daniel Sturridge. 
he's such an underrated player on this game. I remember when he first came out and he cost like 50k. And I'm not honestly surprised because he's got everything. He's got pace, he's got four stars, he's got good ball control and dribbling. Look, nice little turn there. Easy finish into the back of net. He's a he's a all round really, really good striker in my opinion. If he carries on with his run, he has done. Eliar is on the ball. Nice little bit of skill. Can he finish? Oh, absolutely tidy goal. Again by another player. Eliar, left forward. Absolutely fantastic player. I prefer playing 4 3 2 1 to 4 3 3 because I feel the two uh, out wide players aren't so far out. You know, they're more, they're slightly more in. It's more about the three players creating attacks than running down the line and crossing, which is, this is what I prefer. You know, being able to just drill with the three up fronters is brilliant. I'm not sure what he's doing, he wasn't moving then, it was his kickoff, but it's 4-1 at half time, so far it's absolutely brilliant half from our team, um, the squad seems to work together really, really well, I mean, Sturridge is constantly making runs, as is my left forward, uh, Elliot and my right forward, Morales, they're constantly playing off each other, the centre mids have got a lot of, a lot of pace and movement going, I mean, I'm going to wait until the end of the match, but I probably won't include the whole thing, I'm not going to include the whole thing if he's not playing, because there's no point. Yeah, he's 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 not there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to stay in the match, obviously, because I'm not going to quit and get a loss because he's probably doing it on purpose. But I'm going to wait until the end of the match. I'll cut this here though, and then we'll. Oh well, for you guys, I'll be back in like a second because I'm going to wait till the end of the match uh, and talk about the team a little bit more. So yeah, I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, so he actually just started playing again. Um, so I've. Yeah, start recording again and we'll, we'll continue with this. Don't tell me it disappeared again. That, oh, he literally just started playing again, so I've plugged everything back in and now he's gone again. I don't really know what to do. I think he's quit, so I'll stop recording, you know. Then he comes back, so I can start recording again, and then as soon as I start recording, he's gone. Like, I don't know. <laughs> I think he's just sort of given up, so he's just playing every like, here and there sort of thing. Another free kick. Right. It's the end of the game and he's just fucking about, but you know what, if we can score this free kick, I, st I still love free kicks, so I'm going to try and bury this, hopefully, into the top corner, see if we can do it. Come on, Sturridge. What a beautiful free kick, mate. Oh, my days. What a free kick. Did you just see that? Daniel Sturridge, absolutely insane free kick. I mean, I think that was post bar floor, post in, like something ridiculous like that. Sturridge again, he wants more, definitely wants more, will he get more, of course he's going to get more, he's still going, right at the end, ninth minute, that's 8-1 now, 8-1, this team, ladies and gentlemen, is the best team you will get on FIFA for under 30k, I can almost promise you that, everything you everything you could possibly want in a team, this squad has got, we won, so I've had to shut my window, the sun is coming in and it's so bright, I can't even see, uh, yeah, we won 8-1 in the end, I think it was. The team costs literally under 30,000 coins and it's able to do this to, to, to people. You know, it's an unbelievable team. I highly recommend it. Thanks for, uh, for watching. I really appreciate it. I hope you've enjoyed the video. Leave a comment, whatever you want. Like the video because that's just what I need. And of course, if you haven't already, please subscribe. I need as many subscribers as possible. So far, it's going so well and I'm absolutely loving doing this. Can't wait to continue doing it and just see what where it goes, really. So thanks for watching. I'll see you next video. Peace does have four star I believe yes there it is four star coming into play already what about the shot oh what a what a start